art is a space in which we can reflect on what is happening around us. It is a space in which we are able to imagine other realities. And art is also something that speaks, whether overtly or not, about the realities we live in. My name is Hedwig Barry, I'm 51. For the BMW project, I created an aluminium crumple. For the crumple, there are three important things. The first is making the invisible visible. The second was to talk about something that is not perfect anymore, having inherent value. I made these paper crumples by hugging the paper and I wanted to really think about how, even if something is damaged, the paper that I'd hugged had been damaged and was not really pristine anymore, so I wasn't going to use it. And then I started working on it and creating the work on paper. I researched crumples and crumpling and I came across the idea of the crumple zone that is part of the safety feature of contemporary or modern motor vehicles. Crumple zones are the spaces in vehicles that are invisible, that are engineered to absorb force and as a result um, preserves the life of the person inside the vehicle. So and we don't like to think of accidents but I, I love the fact that this is anticipated and that engineered to, to preserve life. I translated the the crumple into a material that would be um, usable outside. So I used aluminium and I specifically chose aluminium because the bonnet area, the crumple zone area in BMWs is made out of aluminium. And the third thing that I wanted to talk about was partiality or subjectivity. We see a great deal of people seeing only their own point of view in the world at the moment. And what the sculpture does is as you move around, it changes dramatically. It becomes something different. As your viewpoint changes, literally, the sculpture changes too. You are also never able to see the whole sculpture in one go because of the size and because of the fact that it's three-dimensional. And this was important for me to think about how perspectives change, how we can always only see partially what is in front of us, but to know that there's more around the corner, to understand that there is a view that is not a, a complete view, a whole view. Thereby encouraging people to look at things from many different angles and not just their own one perspective.